Hi friends, you are now ready to create a skeleton for the robot or a human character or some cartoonic figure or some animal character. All of the organic characters are animated by skeletons made by joints and bones. To do so, you need to determine the proper placement of each joint. Once that is done, you will need to set a proper joint orientation so that when you rotate a joint, it rotates in an intuitive manner. If you do not take great care for placement and orientation, you will have difficulty later animating the character. So now open the robot scene for this lesson. and save your file as test joints. In this step, you need to determine a good placement for the pelvis bone, which will be the root of the hierarchy. Once that is done, it will be easy to create the rest of the spine bones. Select Skeleton, Joint Tool. Make the side view active. Make the side view active. Now you need to LMB click to create the pelvis joint, the neck and the head joint. It is recommended that the pelvis joint be aligned with the hips, the neck and the head. And the head should also be centered to the edgymetry. It is recommended that the pelvis joint be aligned with the hips. The neck and head should also be centered to the edgymetry. A human spine would require many more bones but that is not required in this example. Close the camera to you and create first joint right on the pelvis and click for second joint on the neck and now you are going to draw four joints, one for the pelvis this will be the root joint for all of the skeleton. Second for the neck. Third for the head. And fourth for the mouth. 